All right, guys, today we're going to learn how to set up our MetaMask. So let's get started. So uh, the first thing we're going to do is type in MetaMask. And then we're going to look for this uh, website, MetaMask.io. So we're going to click on the link. And then we're going to click on download. You can either click download here or up here. It doesn't really matter. I'm going to click it up here. And then I'm going to install MetaMask on Chrome, but MetaMask also support Firefox, Brave, Edge, and Opera. Um, so keep that in mind. But I'm going to use Chrome, so I'm going to click on Chrome. Now I'm going to add to Chrome, but before I do that, I'm just going to show you something. So currently up top, uh, I don't have Firefox on my my web browser so I just wanted to show you how it looked before I add it so now we're going to add MetaMask so click on add to Chrome and click on add extension now we're going to click on create a new wallet since this is our first time um, opening up a uh, MetaMask now we're going to click on I agree and now we're going to um, make a new password Make sure your password is at least eight characters minimum. I recommend having one letter capitalized. Also, make sure you add a special character and some numbers. But uh, let me add mine really quick. All right, once you add your um, password twice, we're going to click on this little box right here. And then click on uh, create a new wallet now we're going to secure our wallet so click on this now for this step right here uh, this is your uh, secret recovery phrase all of the old school guys know this as the c phrase they recently changed the name just to make it more obvious um, on what is this phrase that you're going to look at so this right here is equivalent to your social security number this is something that you do not want to share with no one if someone recover this these words right here you're basically done like they can they can basically liquidate your entire account so do not give no one this secret recovery phrase but since this is a demo and i'm going to delete this account once i finish this tutorial I don't mind showing you guys how everything looks so let's get started so we're going to click on reveal secret recovery phrase and what you want to do is copy these words down so i'm going to write it down on a piece of paper i don't recommend taking pictures of this stuff or putting this on your on your computer because if someone hack your computer or your phone they can recover this so I'm just going to write this stuff down really, really quick. And um, after I write it down, we're going to use these words for the next step. So make sure to write this down now before you go to the next step. So let me do that really quick. All right. So I just made a copy of my uh, recovery phrase. So let's go to the next step. We're going to click on next here. Now make sure you look at my um, words. They are in a specific order. So uh, just keep that in mind. So. Let's go to the next step. So once you click on next, you're going to see this confirmation of your recovery phrase. So you're just going to type in the words for um, the numbers that they have late. So let's get started. Fall for number four, mods was gauge. Number eight was scattered. All right, I'm going to click on confirm. Now I'm going to click on got it. Then click on next done and now i'm going to click on enable security alerts all right guys i'm going to exit out of this exit out of this and congratulations guys your wallet is now set up so we now have a metamask and we can see it right here this is my account number this is your public key so it's okay to share this this is what you're going to give everybody your friends and family if you want them to send you money so now what we're going to do is we're going to go up top to the right and we're going to click on this puzzle icon right here when you click on that you're going to see your metamask inside of your this puzzle icon what i'm going to do is click on pin and when i click on it 
it's going to pop up here. If I unclick it, it's going to be inside of this puzzle icon. I like to have mine outside, so I like to keep mine pinned. So when I go to my, my web browser, it'll be right up here. It's easier for me to, you know, click on my MetaMask and sign in. Now what I want to show you guys is just a couple of more settings. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change my account name. So I'm going to click on these three dots right here. Um, go to account details. And then we're going to click on this pencil icon. And I'm going to change my account name to test. So once I click on that, it's going to change your account name. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this little icon right here. Click on that. And then I'm going to go to settings. Inside your settings, the most important thing would be your security and privacy. Click on that. And then what you can do is, let's say for whatever reason, you lose your, your piece of paper with your recovery phrase on it. You can always go to security and privacy and reveal your recovery phrase. So I can go in here, click on this, put in my password. Click on next. And then it's going to show me my recovery phrase. So let's say for whatever reason you forgot to write it down at the beginning. No worries. You can always go into your account and um, look up your recovery phrase. So that's the good thing about it. Also, you can click on QR and you can also use your uh, like QR scanner as, as well. So um, just keep that in mind. All right, guys, I'm just going to show you guys one more thing, and that's going to be how to create another account. So we're just going to go back to this little icon right here, click on this, and then we're going to click on create another account. So for this account, I'm, I'm going to name it test number two. Click on create, and now I have a new wallet. So for this wallet, my, the last four digits is 7440. For my first wallet, the last four is D926. So I have two wallets now or two accounts now. So, all right, guys, at this point, you should know how to create a MetaMask. You should know how to um, change the name of your account. You should know how to create a new account as well. And also, you should know how to recover your secret recovery phrase. So thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like and also share. Thank you. Peace.